It's a move impacting any high school athlete looking to play in college. A proposed law forcing colleges to pay their athletes. Missouri Representative Emmanuel Cleaver working on this bill. It comes just days after the NCAA voted to allow athletes to profit off their image. 41 Action reporter Mackenzie Nelson with that story. The ad companies are making money. Uh, the, the companies that are paying for the ads are making money. Uh, the networks are making money. The schools are making money. Each year, college sports rakes in about $14 billion. Congressman Cleaver says for too long, colleges and universities have spent money earned by the athletes' blood, sweat, and tears. Now he wants athletes to get their fair share. We're not talking about paying them the same kinds of salaries that professional football players and uh, professional basketball players are earning. Uh, but we do think that they're being used. Some local parents with soon to be college athletes feel the exact same way. They do put their bodies through a lot, mm -hmm. you know, for uh, for the for the game and for the college. So for them to have some sort of percentage or something uh, back to them is is wonderful and just it just shows the appreciation with our kids are going through. Everything is not guaranteed. Not every student athlete gets a full scholarship um, with athletics. So I know that we're looking at multiple ways to be able to pay for my son's school. So I think that's a positive and will actually help the entire family and what they're trying to do to help their child, you know, succeed to get through college. However, there are some hurdles, including how much money athletes would get. Cleaver says he does not want to create a competitive system where top athletes only go to schools that pay the most money. I think people will uh, mis, uh, construe what we're trying to do if they think we're trying to pay athletes uh, two or three hundred thousand dollars a year uh, because we're not, but they ought to get something. Mackenzie Nelson, 41 Action News. Now, while Congressman Cleaver says they will find a way to make it an equitable system and still ensure college athletes get paid, the NCAA is working to update their rules as well, saying they want to have them implemented by January 2021.